A new tonight, homelessness continues to be a concern here in Erie County, especially this time of year. According to the Homeless Alliance of Western New York, there were just under 6,000 homeless people registered or listed, I should say, in Erie County last year. And as two on your sides, Leanne Stuck reports, there are some people who saw the need. They wanted to do something about it. Ron, I'm in Cathedral Park where volunteers were here earlier today giving the gift of warmth this holiday season. Take a look at this tree. As you can see, there is winter gear all over it for anybody who is in need to take. I am in the area, I am in the area and I see the people here uh, in need. Steve Paradowski works near Cathedral Park in Buffalo. He says one day it dawned on him. I was outside and I looked at the park uh, one of these uh, a couple times and uh, thought it would be very cool if we had scarves hanging off of the, off the trees. So he took the idea to his church. I asked our, uh, our folks at, at church who were knitters to knit me uh, about 40 scarves. Well, the story grew and it grew and it grew. Uh, went on Facebook and friends and people spread the word. And we ended up with over 300 pieces to hang on these trees today. Sunday volunteers stapled hats, scarves, gloves, and socks to trees for anyone in need to take. There's still kind people in the world willing to help, willing to, to make a difference in somebody's life. A church in West Seneca is also working to help those in need by making sure they have gifts under the tree. We have done this, done an angel tree, which is behind me as long as I can remember. The church contacts the West Seneca School District for information on families in need then volunteers purchase those presents to go under the tree. I guess that's our greatest gift is seeing those tears and knowing the, the gratitude, the, the thankfulness, just the happiness that they're experiencing. Whether it's warm clothes or gifts, the City of Good Neighbors continues to help others this holiday season. Purchasing a scarf or, or making a scarf and making somebody warm in the City of Buffalo, it makes me happy. And I did get a chance to speak to some people who live in the area who tell me that they see the need. They're happy to see volunteers step up and help them keep warm this winter. In Buffalo, Leanne Stuck, Channel 2 News.